Russian authorities are illegally detaining migrants without food and water and using physical violence against them to force them to sign military contracts. The Institute for the Study of War, ISW, said this. The Russian opposition news outlet Okno has highlighted concerns raised by lawyers and human rights activists who report that nearly all detained migrants are being pressured into signing military contracts. Russian authorities are reportedly using threats of stripping naturalized citizens of their Russian citizenship and offering citizenship to migrants as incentives for military enlistment. Okno noted that the frequency of raids targeting migrants has escalated since the terrorist attack at Crocus City Hall in March 2024. On the 29th of July, Vyacheslav Volodin, the chairperson of the State Duma, proposed that Duma members draft legislation mandating military service registration for new Russian citizens upon obtaining their passports. The Duma is also considering amendments to double the mandatory military service period for new citizens from one year to two and to increase the draft age, though the specific new age has not been disclosed. Russia needs soldiers, and its authorities are increasingly turning to migrants to fill the military's ranks. Guest workers from other countries are often rounded up on the street, taken to recruitment offices and pressured into signing contracts with the Russian Defense Ministry. This process can involve threats and violence. At the same time, migrants are offered a quick path to Russian citizenship if they join the military. Activists also warned of another way that Russian authorities recruited migrants. In some migration center, where people come to obtain work and residence permits as well as other official documents, officials force them into signing contracts with the military. They give them a whole folder of documents, up to 40 sheets of paper, and give them half a minute to read through it. There is a massive line behind them, no time to read, and many sign up without looking. And then it turns out that they have signed a contract to serve in the military. Another way to add new soldiers to the ranks is at the migrant detention centers housing people awaiting deportation. The detainees are told that they will obtain Russian citizenship after six months if they join the military. If they refuse, they are threatened, told they would be forgotten and spend the rest of their lives in detention. In May 2023, Russian President Vladimir Putin signed a decree simplifying the procedure to obtain Russian citizenship for foreigners who signed a one-year contract with the Defense Ministry during the Ukraine war. Since then, there have been increasing reports of people applying for Russian citizenship only to be sent to a recruitment office and pressured to enlist.